Hit and killed a woman crossing the road in public square was just indicted by a grand jury. 35-year-old Antoinette Peterkin is facing aggravated vehicular homicide and vehicular homicide charges in the death of 69-year-old Joan Kundig. Our Tara Molina joins us live now from Public Square with the very latest. And Tara, just an awful incident here, and you're standing right where it all happened. Absolutely, Rob. Such a tragic incident here in Public Square, and this is exactly where it happened. According to the RTA Review Committee, that driver did not come to a full stop. She just slowed down, and they say that this tragic incident was totally avoidable. But obviously nothing set in stone here, no real official comment until the jury's decision here today. A grand jury announcing the felony charges today, aggravated vehicular homicide and vehicular homicide. I checked in with the union president representing drivers. He hadn't learned of the charges yet, but called the past few months heartbreaking. They stand by the driver. Joan Kundig was legally crossing Rockwell when she was hit by the RTA bus, making a left-hand turn around 7.30 in the morning. She died at Metro Health Medical Center weeks later. The fatal accident was part of a heated debate to keep bus traffic to a minimum through Public Square. Public Square opened to buses in March. The driver, Antoinette Peterkin, was fired back in January. Now, Peterkin's arraignment is set for May 10th. Court records do not indicate whether or not she will have an attorney present with her. But we will continue to stay on top of this case and bring you the very latest in the proceedings. Reporting live in Public Square, I'm Tara Molina, News 5.